Electronic Jackboard Machine Engineers must have the following nine basic knowledge. 2. Modules of Electronic Jackboard Machines In Electronic Jackboard Machines, the mechanical part of the Jackboard Machine and the electrical part of the Jackboard Machine, they are serve the all modules of the Jackboard Machine. Enable all modules to function properly, because the weaving process of electronic jackboard machines depends on the normal operation of all modules. Any module that works abnormally will result in fabric errors. The mechanical part of the electronic jackboard machine and the electrical part of the electronic jackboard machine cooperate to ensure the normal operation of all modules. In theory, the mechanical part of the electronic jackboard machine. All the lifting knives reach the highest position simultaneously. The electrical part of the electronic jackboard machine defaults to all lifting knives reaching the highest position. But it is allowed that all lifting knives may not reach the highest position at the same time. So it is necessary to adjust the power on angle. Usually, all modules of electronic jackboard machines come from the same supplier, same model, and same batch. In this way, the lifting height range and adjustment method of the jackboard machine are fixed by the electronic jackboard machine manufacturer. The tooling used to adjust the lifting height of the knife has also been determined. The three main lines of a module in the figure are the baseline, the position when electromagnetic attraction, and the position when electromagnet release. The distance between baseline and the position when electromagnetic attraction is height of lifting knife. Baseline of the module serves as the reference for the electronic jackboard machine. All modules are fixed and installed in the module box. And baseline of all modules are in the same plane, which is base plane of the jackboard machine. The module box in the mechanical part of the electronic jackboard machine has high precision requirements for this plane. Whether it is a flat or inclined opening, regardless of the size of the opening, this base plane will be ensured when the knife reaches the highest position. That is to say, the lifting height of each module should be ensured. In practical work, the height of lifting knife is 1. It is divided into static lifting height and dynamic lifting height. 2. The height of lifting knife during static state mainly depends on the static deformation of the lifting knife. 3. The height of lifting knife during dynamic operation mainly depends on the dynamic deformation of the lifting knife. 4. Electronic jackboard machines often need to detect and adjust the height of the static lifting knife during installation and debugging. When there is an error in the fabric surface exceeding one hook, during regular maintenance and upkeep, etc. Once it is found that the lifting height of the static state exceeds the range provided by the electronic jackboard mechanism manufacturer, the lifting knife needs to be replaced. 5. Long-term dynamic deformation of the lifting knife may evolve into static deformation of the lifting knife. This can be detected by detecting the height of lifting knife during static state. 6. The dynamic deformation of the lifting knife can be found indirectly through the mechanical fluctuation in the real-time online detection data. 7. The tool for adjusting the lifting height of the knife is used to detect the lifting height during static state, usually with an accuracy of 0.1 millimeters.
8. The height of lifting knife during static state should not be too high or too low. When it is too high, it can cause impact on the module box, reduce the lifespan of the electronic jackward machine, and even lead to fabric errors. When it is too low, it may cause the attraction of the electromagnet of module to fail, usually resulting in fabric errors at low speeds or during inch the loom. We will provide free technical support. Please send me all the real-time online detection data of this jackward machine. I will interpret these real-time online detection data. Propose suggestions and work with engineers to solve the current problem with this jackboard machine. In the process of solving problems, we also learn from engineers. Thank you for watching this video. Goodbye.